guys i'm just gonna do this quick video of the, the second part of my full week doing uber eats you might be wondering in the title i put fourteen hundred dollars and i actually only did thirteen fifty five as it says on the app and as i showed but i am also considering some cash tips that i had i got no <laughs> nobody gives a 20 uh, gives a 50 dollar tip I'm just kidding. Uh, I got that $10, actually. This is the actual $10 that I got for like delivering just three pizza, quite close, very kind woman. Gave me $10. And I also got like $6 in coins. And it's not $6 here. I had to use those $6 for like a bus ride or anything. But anyways, so that's like $16 more, which bring us to uh, I think 81 or something or around 70 80 and there's also those glasses I needed some new glasses as I lost my ones that I had uh, in New Zealand so it's the weather the summer is coming here in Australia so I'm gonna need some sunglasses so it's an expense that I won't have to do I was planning on I was planning on paying more than a hundred dollars so uh, I uh, as a, they're not completely brand new if I'm on the ground and everything did a bit scratch but in similar condition as the one I had uh, I value them as about $30 so if you add up $16 plus about $30 worth of sunglasses that I broke but repaired but repaired again and whatever uh, I think it's 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 fair to Put it at fourteen hundred, and it makes it a round number. It just looks better in the video. Anyways, uh, let's go with the rest of the week. so I have to find a new branch but that is today it is Friday fifth day of the challenge uh, I reached my goal almost my goal on almost every day and the weekend with the bonus should catch up so I can make around two hundred dollars a day and end the week with fourteen hundred which would be great so yeah let's go do this and work and work and work in that kind of weather it's not too much of a problem <laughs> Delivery, let's go. Alright, it's 11. I already made about 30 bucks. Uh, and I'm going back to the center because at 12 the uh, incentive starts. Just gonna film the way down. It's I'm on top of North Court here. The building behind me is pretty nice. And the way down is pretty cool too.
six of six of the challenge. Uh, waking up as usual. Uh, I I open eyes well, a little bit before eight o'clock and get out of bed around eight thirty or something. I'm gonna go have breakfast and same thing. It's the way repeating always the same. That's why I'm only doing it for one week. So today is very quiet in terms of Uber Eats. I've done like three in an hour and 20 minutes since midday, which is not very normal, but anyways, four I guess. And I'm running out of space on the SD card, so that'll be it until I go back home to get the skateboard. SD card change, let's get back out there. I'm just gonna explain you one thing that I do when I do those time lapse and like especially now that I have the gimbal to make it turn is that I find something ugly to put the tripod on that way that thing it's it's on it's not in the frame and it's one less ugly thing that will be in my shot like a trash can or those switchboards here right behind me for electricity and stuff like that or like maybe like those those things like arrange stuff like to protect they're not really pretty so find something ugly that you don't want in your shot and put your camera on if you can So yeah, I'm happy that it's the last day. I'm getting tired of this and, and physically tired and figuratively really tired. Not mentally tired, it's not very mentally challenging. And yeah, let's go get ready. It's a bit later than usual, it's like 9, 10. All right, so I'm doing things a bit differently today. Um, taking it to outside of the promotion zone because yesterday was a mess I, it was just a waste of time so i kind of got led to mooney pounds which is way up but way too far from what i was expecting so far but yeah i'm just gonna try to like reach back to closer to home and stay around those part and not focus too much on the promotion because I think that the promotion is uh, it's like it's overcrowded with people doing deliveries so you end up just wasting time and just not like there's too many delivery guys and not enough orders so you're just not busy at all uh, and yeah 10% if you're not if you don't get that much work, it's not it's not worth it. So 
So yeah, I'm just gonna go and check some other places. It's also nice to see like different neighborhoods. Never been to Mooney Barns before. about half an hour ago I got back from my trip with the skateboard uh, I didn't take the camera which is actually a good thing in the end because 
I got hit by a car. I'm fine. Just, just like I was on Brunswick Street and the cycle lane, blasting with the skateboard, and that car just came to cross the street and cut me off. He couldn't see me because I think the tram was on my right or something, and it's just I was hidden and he was hidden. Uh, so yeah, we couldn't see each other, and uh, he ran into me and I ran into him. I just um, bumped over his hood and stuff. I didn't. It didn't even really hurt or anything. All right, I'm calling it a week. Uh, the challenge is finished. My bicycle says. I did around 485 kilometers in one week. The reason I'm calling it done at 9, 9 past 9 and uh, at like $993 dollars instead of my uh, 200 goal and more to compensate uh, is because <laughs> of what you're witnessing behind me it's pouring rain my bike is actually not electric anymore because there's like probably it should be working in the rain but it's not uh, when there's too much rain so yeah uh, that's done for me and uh, the total that I made is uh, 1355 dollars uh, I'm like yeah 45 dollars under the target that I had which is fine considering I had rain on the two first days and there's rain again uh, rain makes you a lot of money if you don't mind it with Uber Eats in my case it's like especially with when it stops being electric it's just it. So yeah, to uh, summarize the week, it started shitty and it finished shitty. So yeah, I don't know if I'm gonna do another one of those challenge anytime soon uh, to maybe try to beat my record. But for now, it is done. Okay, now that's it for that big week. Uh, I'm planning on doing another one but not anytime soon. This current place I'm living in is quite far away from all those uh, easy place to do Uber Eats so I'll have to evaluate how to do it better from here. Uh, but within the cu next couple months uh, I might do another week, maybe even more than that. I'm considering like at some point once I've finished one of my projects I'm just gonna have that to do and I'll just do it as much as I can and see what I can do in a whole month. Probably not four times 1400 because it's way, way too much time and it would like probably kill me. But we'll see. So thank you for watching. I hope you like. If you really like this video, like I already have a bunch of thumbs up. But if you really like this type of video and seeing me doing ovaries and going around Melbourne, just tell me I'll do more of it uh, it's always a pleasure uh, remember that if it's easy it's not funny and see you in the next one